Afternoon everyone, it's Cargo Bike Cowboy here again. Got a little update on the trailer. So, here's where we're at now. You can see I've installed some of the hitch. There's the, the long post for the hitch. Here's how it connects to the bike. That's a little fork off a kid's bike. Front hub clamped there in the steer tube. Got some more paint on it. Was able to get some paint on it today. Unfortunately, I would have had the whole thing painted, but I could only get three cans of this colonial red is the color I chose. And that's all I could get was three cans. They didn't have any more. I checked Walmart, I checked Lowe's. I just haven't been able to get any more yet, but I will. And then I'll be able to finish uh, painting it. <clears throat> I did make a new plate today, which straightened out my wheel. My wheel is now sitting the way it should. It's all good. I also uh, took apart this front hub on this wheel, cleaned it all up, cleaned the wheel up, uh, trued it up, took out all the bearings in the headset and cleaned and re-greased all of that as well as the bearings up here in this front hub. All of it was cleaned up, re-greased, put back together. So, she's looking pretty good. We'll give her a little little spin here. I'm just holding the hitch in my hand. As you can see, she maneuvers real well. Follows right along. gonna be real nice when it gets on to the big dummy so that's the progress I made today wish I could have got further I was working on the hitch part to the big dummy which will attach here at the seat post but that piece of metal is square and this is rectangular so I'm having to cut into the sides to fold it in kind of squish it and make it square so that tube will slide up on there. Then there'll be a hole drilled through it and there'll be a cotter pin that attaches it. Right now it's just kind of a mess there. Ran out of uh, juice for my batteries for my cutting wheel. So it's gonna stay like that till I'm over here next time. That's the hitch system I come up with. This piece was actually on one of those uh, clamp on rear racks that just clamp onto your seat, but this is a good piece of steel. It's strong. I put a bolt through it instead of that quick release. So as soon as I'm able to cut more of the sides out and scrunch that down and manipulate it, you gotta like squish it down and squish it this way. It takes a little time to get all that done. If I hadn't ran out of battery juice, I would have had it done. But that's where we're at right now. So there she is. We'll do a walk around real quick. I think she's going to ride real nice. I'm not sure about the, you know, attaching it to my seat post, that, that type of hitch system. But if it doesn't work well, we'll just make something else. But I'm sure it'll be fine. So there she is. That's my update for today. It's my video of the day. Y'all have a good time. Enjoy your lives. Ride safe. And I'm out.